Welcome back to the new video. As you already get the idea from the title and thumbnail of this video. In today's video, we will talk about the government jobs you can apply for after pharmacy graduation. So, without any further delay, let's get start with the video. The first job on the list is to become a drug inspector. A drug inspector is a pharmacy professional who is an expert in monitoring and executing the safety, efficiency, quality, and usefulness of drugs from the manufacturing stage to the selling stage. Majority of you will believe that it is extremely difficult or impossible to get job as drug inspector. But believe me, if you think about it, you can do it. The pharmaceutical industry is showing tremendous growth since past few years in India. Considering this fact, demand of the drug inspectors are of higher side now. Also, the career as drug inspector is considered as the most sorted profession in the field of pharmacy. To become a drug inspector, candidates are required to go through a selection process conducted by the UPSC, which is Union Public Service Commission, or SPSC, which is State Public Service Commission. Every year, every state's public service commission have some open vacancies for drug inspectors. For example, for Maharashtra state, we have MPSC, which is Maharashtra Public Service Commission. Similarly, we have Public Service Commission for each state. You need to visit the official website of state to see the open vacancies. The second job on the list is to become food inspector. The FSSAI, which is Food Safety and Standards Authority of India is a government body established by Government of India's Ministry of Health and Family Welfare. The organization was established under Food Safety and Standards Act of 2006, which governs food safety and regulation in India. The main role of FSSAI is to protect public health by regulating and supervising food safety. And to perform this activity, they required food inspectors. You can visit to the FSSAI's official website for available job vacancies. The third job on the list is to work in the governmental bodies on various positions. What do you mean by government bodies? There are several government bodies in India wherein pharmacists are required. Few of them are listed below. The first one is CDSCO, which stands for Central Drug Standard Control Organization. This is simply Indian Regulatory Authority for Cosmetic Products, Pharmaceutical Products, and Medical Devices. The next government body is PCI, which stands for Pharmacy Council of India. It is constituted under the Pharmacy Act 1948. The next one is IPC, which stands for Indian Pharmacopoeia Commission. This body is in charge of establishing standards for all drugs which are manufactured, sold, and consumed, in India. Next body, which is the last one in my list is ICRISAT, which stands for International Crops Research Institute for the Semi-Arid Tropics. Although, this organization is related to agriculture, there are still a few openings for pharmacists. Please visit the official website of all these bodies for open vacancies. Please leave a comment below if you know of any other government body which hire pharmacists. The fourth job option on the list is to work as a pharmacist in government organizations. This job falls under the subcategory paramedical staff. This job allows you to work as a pharmacist and hospital pharmacist in a wide range of government and semi-government hospitals. Apart from this, paramedical jobs for pharmacists are also available in the Indian Army. Indian Air Force, and Indian Navy. The fifth and final government job on the list is to become a teacher in a government colleges. If you want to pursue a career in teaching, a higher education will help you progress in the field. So, according to my understanding, these are the few best government jobs available right now, and you can apply for them almost every year. Another important point to note is that almost all of the government jobs I mentioned in the video, required specific examinations to pass. I have provided link of few of the websites in the video description. Please visit the websites and start searching for open vacancies. 
That's all for today. If you enjoy the video, please share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel. All the best on your job search journey and I will see you soon in the next video.